My dad worked for Ingersoll Rand for 40 years, starting in 1970. My mom worked for Ingersoll Rand for 23 years, starting in 1969. This company helped raise me. This company sees something in you. That's, that's something to smile about. We have a company that gives us something, right? They didn't have to, but they did. And I have pictures of my girls in my office, right? Uh, because that's my why, right? That's my why that I'm going to work, right? That's the why that I'm coming here. To know that the company has in turn given me the controls to generate more wealth for them, for me, it makes me feel great. It makes me hungry. It, it makes me want to drive even harder. It makes me want to go in and, and execute even more. By offering you know, everyone the stock grant, I believe it lets them know that this company will take care of you. They want to take care of their people. You always have a different mentality when you're an owner in something. You're looking at every little thing down to the detail to see how I can make it more efficient. You see the team much more engaged and wanting to think differently about a problem. And that's what I try to instill in my team. It's not yours, it's not mine, it's ours. The employees on the floor, the machine operator, all the way down from one end of the spectrum, A to Z. Everybody's got their job here and they know it. My team members, I'm not gonna say an employee, team member, because we're all in this together, value what they do. And I see that on a constant basis, all of them. And it matters to them, the livelihood of this company. Instead of the decisions coming from the top down, the decisions are coming from the bottom up. You're getting a lot more connected ways to solve these problems than just sitting in a meeting room trying to whiteboard it or put it on a piece of paper. Back in the day, you always hear about CEOs getting lured from one company to another company for these big stock equities and all this type of stuff, um, but it's never to the employees, right? But here, the philosophy is a little bit different to where, hey, now we're issuing it out to everyone within the company. That's walking the walk. It's yours, and you want the best. I want the best. And in order for me to want the best, I got to give the best that I have. If you think about all the hours that I, you know, I've spent coming in here, this is your home away from home. The way I view it now as an owner, the work, the grind that I'm putting in away from my family is gonna drive that stock price, which ultimately turns into my money um, and supporting my family. One of the things that my father-in-law taught me was at a young age, I always ask them what they wanna do. Hey, what do you wanna be when you grow up, right? Where do you wanna to go to college at? Knowing that we have a plan to be able to support them and get them to those goals, it's really rewarding for myself and my wife. Knowing that we have the stock grant from Ingalls on Rand, knowing that it's there, it's a nest egg. You have some money that you didn't have in the beginning and that you can do anything with it that you want. I had to have some of that money to help with my daughter's education. She's my baby girl. and She works over in the receiving department. I'm in a better place than I was 10 years ago. I'm financially stable. My kids are grown. They're financially stable, they're in college, all because of this company. There's also some folks that it came as a godsend. And at that time of need, it pulled them out of maybe of losing something at home. Whatever it may be, it was there for them. Yeah, that's, that's big. Ingersoll Rand has given me everything I've got today. And in turn, raised my family the Ingersoll stock grant, it does give me security. I will use it if I need it, but I'm gonna let it grow. I won't let it grow just like I grew here. It puts me where I'm at, it gives me the freedom to do what I wanna do, and it gives me the inspiration to keep going.